morning everybody. I feel like a mess I haven't even started yet. I have showered, I've washed my hair, I've dried my hair, but it is so humid today, it's ridiculous. So I've got the air conditioner um, blaring up, well not blaring, but it's on up here and I tell you what, I just went downstairs to the office to do a couple of things real quick and immediately it started to trickle. So I'm like, let me get back upstairs. So instead of a sec, I have my second cup of coffee while I'm doing makeup. Uh, I went with the iced coffee. So, can't handle anything hot at the moment. It's funny because when Ash left this morning, she goes, Mom, when you go downstairs, can you put the air on in my room for Melly? I said, no problem, because Ash had to leave. She left at like 20 past seven this morning. Anyway guys, I'm going to attempt to put some makeup on. I'm not going to do much. I did use today the Sephora. I bought some tanner for the face, some self tanner. And I thought it was going to be this cream. I really hate the smell of creams, but everyone was saying how good this is. And it's actually a tanning water. It looks like a toner. So what you do is you put it on um, a cotton wool ball and just soak your face with it. So I think it's going to be quite good. I'll see. It says it gradually starts to f um, to fade. It gradually starts to go into the color. Use it daily until you get to the color you want, and then just use it sporadically. So we'll see. It doesn't have that nasty tanning smell, which I can't stand. I need to do something about the arms, legs, and everything else. So of course I went right down here because I wanted to make sure I didn't have like a line. But it's quite different. I'll uh, I'll let you know how it goes. I have no clue yet what it's going to be like but I'm going to start wearing foundation and stuff especially when it's so hot like this even though the one I have is the Michael nope not Michael the Marc Jacobs one and it's very very fine this one it's very light I mean not fine I don't even know the right technology and my brain is already fried so anyway I'm going to go put some mascara on and stuff like that just to make myself presentable and um I'll see you all soon. I hope you're all having a fabulous Friday so far. I hope it's a little cooler where you are, or if it's not cooler, I hope it's not humid. So I'll talk to you soon. Bye, guys. All ready. I'm just going to sit here now. I'm sit I've got the chair over by the bed. I'm not sitting on the bed. I changed my sheets again. I haven't. Uh, it's just been so hot. We've been sleeping on top of the bed, but I want to change the sheet. Louis's all heavy panting. Poor little thing. Roxy's gone over there because she's mad I won't let her lick my arms, but I've just put perfume on and all that good stuff. I told you I wear perfume every day, and I've just sprayed my hair so it has the uh, humidity block, the one I got from Ashley's store. And I'm just going to sit up here for a while because it's nice and cool. I can feel the fan and the air conditioner from here. And um, I want to see how that tanner... I have been wearing a 50 on my face, SPF 50, under my anything, but Ashley taught me something the other day. She said, if you put your suntan lotion on your face, you know the one for the face, obviously, and she goes, and then you put a foundation on top, and it's common sense, but it's something I've never thought about. You are, even though you've got a 50 on your face, and then you put the foundation on, if your foundation's only a 20, then you're only going to get the 20 SPF, do you know what I mean? So... Um, I was like, yeah, that's a good point, actually. So whatever is the last thing you put on your entire face is the SPF number you're going to get protected from. She did have a silly question. Well, if I put 50 on my face, the cream, and then I put a 20, isn't that 70? No, even I know it doesn't work like that. <sighs> silly questions, silly questions. I'll talk to you guys in a bit. Bye. Wow. Did it get busy? I came down to messages on the machine, returned everybody's calls went then we got the mail and the check i'd been waiting for came so i thought let me go run that over to the bank and you know i didn't even give it a second thought i went out in this tank top and, and shorts i have two tank tops on i always wear two always wear one of these ones underneath and then whatever even a t-shirt tank tops all year long 365 days a year so i went over to the bank I even went in didn't think i was going to find parking it was like lunch hour in the bank there was a car sitting outside and as i'm pulling in my driveway the girl looks over and i recognize her from the school she's a senior her and a friend so they gave me a couple of minutes to come in and then they were dropping off forms like i said what happened now people will drop them off rather than mail them which is great i prefer that for that part but once katie's here it gets a bit tough this afternoon 
So, so far all's going good. More messages on the machine, so just return those phone calls. Quarter to two already, I can't believe it. I just made myself a chicken salad sandwich for lunch with tomato and um, I was gonna have a cup of tea, but I can't be bothered. I want something quick and cold, so I poured a nice iced, iced, ice cold glass of Coke and put a bunch of ice in it and some lemon, how about that? And here's my sandwich. Because I know you're all interested. And this this was the Brittany one, so Brittany I gave a shout out to yesterday or the day before. But then I just had two confused parents on the phone, so I took care of them. They're all right now. I need that now because I am hungry, thirsty, and hot. So I've got the air on and the fans on. Oh dear. No, it's fine. It's fine, Sue. It's fine. And if it's not fine, you just lop on some foundation and make it even. All right, guys, I'll talk to you in a bit. Bye. Playtime. Meanie. Sven has no antlers. Poor Sven. like it wants to storm, it's very grey. And still and thick, thick hair. Then you come round here. I'm gonna end the vlog here, it's nine o'clock, couple of minutes to nine. It's uh, should have come up here and put the air on in the bedroom for to cool the room off for a little while before I came up because as soon as you get to like the top fourth stair or the stair fourth from the top, it is really hot up here. It's like it hits you, you can't breathe, but you automatically get there. Today's been good. I only left the house once to go put that deposit in. Um, spent a lot of time on the phones this afternoon before Katie came. Katie was well behaved, so that was good. Pete got home. Well, Ash got home from work and then she got changed and went right to the gym. Got back from the gym and then she decided to stay home because she's shattered. She's playing Star Wars downstairs. I'm watching a show called Tanked. And it's as every bit, to me, as boring as it sounds. <laughs> she likes it though. It's about where they make all these really spectacular fish tanks out of things and that's... It's... It's... it's, it's I've been trying to find Big Brother online and I can't find the person that usually puts it up hasn't put it up yet so I'm hoping it goes up soon but I'm also watching Emmerdale Farm uh, yesterday's vlog is just uploading now Pete's where do you think Pete is? I'll give you three guesses and the first two don't count his brother decided he was going to paint some more of the boat when he got home from work Pat gets home from work like three o'clock he's an electrician and they get out at that time so as soon as Pete ate, he says, I'm going to go over there. And off he went. And tomorrow he'll be over there. And Sunday he's going over there because they're going to try and put the boat in the water. So I don't know if I'll see much of Pete this weekend either. I said to him yesterday, you're, not, you're hardly in the vlogs anymore because you're barely around. <sighs> oh well. Anyway, I have to go sit, rest this old back of mine because it's playing up. With the humidity it plays up really bad. And um, I will see you guys tomorrow. I'm going to love and leave you guys for tonight. I hope everybody has had a spectacular Friday. Whatever you guys did today, I hope it was a good one. And uh, I'll talk to you all soon. Bye, guys.